Welcome back, everyone. Ray Ferraro down at ice level. My name is James Sabalski. The EA Sports broadcast team is fired up to bring you this one here tonight. Two teams that play really smart hockey set to go at it tonight, Ray. It doesn't take much to get yourself into trouble. A couple of penalties, a poor penalty kill, and you run yourself in the danger. Both teams really pride themselves on how well they play the game. The officials there at center, and I think we are about to get this one underway. Oh, I've been waiting for this all day, and we are now officially underway. Malkin's got the puck. Moves it quickly over to Huberto. Winnipeg's on the attack. Well, that'll get a response. McCarr's ready to go. Apparently, the other guy doesn't want anything to do with him. Oh, it looks like the trainer's going to meet him at the door here. He's struggling to get off the ice, just trying to get to the bench. Takes the pass. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Puck picked up by Huberto. Wrist shot from the slot. Oh, denies him with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. The Bears will play it in their own end. Sends the pass over. Comes up with the stop. Puts it up front, and they can't connect. Oh, that's tremendous poise in the defensive end to break off the pass. And they fail to go tape to tape. Here's a chance right in front. He scores! What a goal! When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. The Falcons from preaching good start. Mission accomplished here, Ray. Teams always talk about getting the upper hand in a game as quickly as they can. Now you can play from in front. Puck grabbed by Hamilton. And he takes a shot, and that one stopped. Price covers it up for a whistle. Is there a strategy here? Sometimes, or he just reads the play in front of him and says, now I gotta jump on this, we're gonna start to run around. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. We got a one nothing game to this point. The Bears win it. Quick pass to Barkov. Look out! Oh, what a hit! And now he moves it quickly, to, and he's going after him here. Muzzin's turning this challenge down. That's not part of his game. They're going to have to look at him immediately. He's just slowly working his way to the bench, James. Play whistle dead because of an offside. Markov's been in some discomfort since he took this hit. A clean hit right through the body. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Winnipeg's got a hold of the puck off the draw. And he slides it quickly to Dumba. And now it's grabbed by Giordano. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Pokes it away in his own end. Boston's got it across the line. Steps into it. Denies him on the slapper. Pushes it across to Dumba. Moves the puck. Here they are on the attack. Moves it to Muzzin. Boston's got the puck in the defensive end. Takes it from the other side of the blue line. Made the save on the play. Yeah, it's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. Can't hang on after that hit. Pokes the puck away. Manages to hang on. Boston's got the puck along the wall. Takes the feed. What a stop as he puts out the fire! Price holds his position really well here. He's able to make the stop. That's a good scoring chance that he snuffs out. Boston's had the scoring opportunities, but they still find themselves behind in the first. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. From the blue line, they take control of it. Way too much congestion blocks that. Down the right side and into the zone. 
Quick feed. Can't connect. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. And now he moves it to Cole. Sends a pass over. He gets a piece of it with a stick. And another stop. Sharp reaction save. Christ might want to tell his defense to get involved in the game here. He's been peppered early. Been real sharp. Past the midway mark of the frame. James and Ray with you tonight. The Falcons lead it 1-0. Offense his own face off and he wins the draw. He got all of that hit. The Falcons take it along the wall. Boston's got the puck along the boards. Provorov's taking it from his own end. And now he tries to get it across to Nylander. Let's it fly. Completely misses on the play. You don't even make the goalie walk here. You've got to make him have to do something in the net. Quick feed to Marner. Handles the puck. Uses the force on that hit. On the attack along the boards. Wrist shot from the slot. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, and another big stop. Up, he flares up the arm with the blocker. Makes a pretty good save here. The Bears must be feeling a little snake bitten, trailing in the late stages of the first. Barkos won it off the faceoff. Here's a short pass to Svechnikov. Boston's got the puck against the boards. Nearing the final 60 seconds here this first period. Oh, that's gotta hurt. What a play. From the left side, they gain the zone. Tries to get it to Malkin. Oh, he laid a solid hit on him there. He was waiting for him and laid the shoulder right into him. That might loosen a few of the choppers on that play. Well, that'll do it for an entertaining opening 20 minutes of hockey as the horn sounds. Winnipeg's game, you gotta like it. Both ends of the ice, solid goaltending and a little bit of offense as they lead it 1-0. And while both teams get a refresher, we'll take one ourselves heading into the second period. And the official seems about ready to drop the puck on period number two. Winnipeg's won the draw. Ovechkin's moving the puck through his own zone. Picked up along the boards by Malkin. From the left side, it moves to the middle of the ice. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Handles the pass from the right wing. Boston's got the puck in their own end. Up the neutral zone now. Boston's across the blue line. Taken by Ristolainen. Moves it quickly over to Huberto. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Takes a shot and he makes the save. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Winnipeg's up one zip. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. A little banging and crashing now. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. He scores! Patrice Bergeron comes through! The goalie's not going to catch this. The pass from behind the net's on the tape. One timed into the cage before he can really get turned around. Winnipeg's now gone up by a pair in the second. So they've got a two-goal lead. Some people say it's the worst lead in hockey. Well, guess what? I'll take the worst lead as opposed to trailing by two. Yeah, you know what's better than down by two? Being up by two, right? Of it Simple! Is. Stones up with the blocker! Receives the pass! And it's a quick pass to Bergeron. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Boston's got it in their own zone. Dishes it to Svechnikov. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Winnipeg's on the attack. 
Boston's gained possession along the boards. Nice zone entry from the middle. That pass doesn't go. Quick pass to Pedersen. Quick pass to Bergeron. And he comes up with the save. And they go back on the attack in the offensive zone. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. The ice have taken possession along the wall. Let's it go from the slot. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Snaps one from the slot. Oh, how do you miss it? Well, you miss it because you're trying to be perfect with it. Really good opportunity that he doesn't cash in. Pavelski's got the puck in his own zone. The Ice have gained possession off the wall. Picked up along the wall by Zabinijan. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Forces the turnover. Moves it to Heiskanen. Nothing doing on that. Takes the feed. Puck not loose in the neutral zone. Couldn't find the intended target. Picks up the puck in his own end. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. The ice have taken possession in their own end. That's a solid check on the play. Nice pass. Along the half wall with the puck. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Oh, oh. Trying to dangle there, but he loses the puck. Now he's got to chase it back. Winnipeg's in transition. Quick feed to Heiskanen. From one point man to another. With the stop. Here's a short pass to Truba. Boston's moving it into the offensive end. To his teammate. And the stick gets a piece of it. Winnipeg's got a hold of the puck. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. He got all of that one. He was locked in there. The Bears have it against the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Winnipeg's got possession at center. Slides the puck over. Now a quick pass to Krug. Here's a chance on the doorstep. And a strong effort on that play. And nearing the final minute of the second. Boston's got it in the offensive zone. He says, let's get physical on that play. Cole's got it against the boards. The Bears gain possession along the wall. Puts it on net. Gets in front of it. Price has had a terrific save percentage tonight. I think James because he's read the play so well. He's on top of the shot before the shooter takes it. And that'll do it for period number two. Winnipeg's been excellent in their own end. They have given up absolutely nothing. And they lead a two-zip. The third period is just around the corner. Ray and I will bring you all the action in a moment. Just moments away from the start of the third period. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go. Third period is underway. Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? Boston's had such a meager total of shots on goal. Predictably, he scores! Perfect timing. Well, they've been trying to get through, break through on this goaltender who's been running a shadow. Finally, they get one. A sweet feed there. The butterfly pass goes across, and the shooter doesn't miss. it suddenly doesn't seem so insurmountable now. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the body language. They know they've got a chance. Puck scooped up by Crew. From the left side, takes it at center. Puck battle along the boards. And he slides it quickly to Marner. Nylander's got the puck along the wing. The Falcons look to start the transition game. Great defensive effort with the stick. Puck picked up by Marner. 
Moves it quickly over to Nylander. Centering pass. Wrists one. Puts it wide. Maybe trying to be a little too fine as he shoots it wide of the net. Ovechkin's picking up steam. Boston's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Slides it over to Matthews. And now he moves it quickly to Nylander. And he slides it quickly to Pavelski. Oh, set that hit up perfectly. Puck grabbed by Dumba. Steps into all of that. Here's the shot. And there's the save. And they can convert to the play. Boston's got it along the wall. Not able to connect. Giordano's lugging the puck. Slides it on over to O'Reilly. And it's a quick pass to Oshie. Takes a shot, and that one's turned away. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. Take it along the wall by Giordano. The Falcons move it ahead. Levels them on the ice. James, I love that hit because it was delivered fast and legally. He put his shoulder right through his chest. And now it's over to Barzell. And that pass goes awry. Dished on over to Truba. Plays the puck up ahead. The Bears played along the boards. Turns it away on the slap shot. Dahlin's not anywhere close to 100% as he finishes this shift. He was banged up during it, and he tried to make sure he got to the end of the shift. Past the midway mark of the frame, it's a 2-1 hockey game. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Oshie. Winnipeg's got it along the wall. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Quick pass to Hughes. He scores! What an effort to get this game back to level. You've got to continue to work even when you trail in the game. They did that, and now they have a brand new game to play. Man, the goalie's going to look at his teammates and say, is anybody going to cover the high slot? He was so open, he was able to hammer home the one-timer. Boston's goal has set up a thrilling finish here in this third period. Really good work to get the game back to level. Now they have to continue to push to find the winner. Scored by number 86, Jack Hughes. And he slides it quickly to Cole. Boston's looking to break out. Takes the pass. Makes the save. Nice push check inside the attacking zone. The Falcons have it from their own end. Moves it to Heiskanen. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Scores! And they go up by one! Tied no more. That's a big goal to be able to take the lead. A uh, goalie burps up this rebound here. It comes right back into the shooting area and the rebound is put away. have to buckle down now here in the back half of this third period. I'm interested to see if the coaching staff still runs four lines or if they'll shrink the bench and try to protect this with three lines. Keeps hold of the puck. Takes the feed at the back end. Quick feed to Provorov. Jostling for the puck and he loses control. Sends the pass over. Takes the feed. Silvers plays the puck. Winnipeg's got a hold of it against the wall. Moves it to the offensive zone. Oh, slick work with the glove by Gibson. Here's a short pass to Pavelski. Jabs the puck away. Tosses it to Malkin. Boston's got the puck along the wall. Gains the zone from the right side. The Bears go to work on offense. The Falcons move the puck in the defensive zone. Malkin's got it along the wing. Now a quick pass to Huberto. Moves the puck. And now he angles it across to Crew. He scores! Oh, the one-timer! Beautiful! The 
good thing he one times this puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. Winnipeg's going to have to make an adjustment here. Their injured player will not be back tonight. Late goings of this period. Winnipeg's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Scooped up along the wall by Nylander with authority. The Bears really need a goal here. They pulled the goalie and the extra attackers out. There's the empty net insurance marker and should bring an end to this one. Yeah, that'll wrap it up. Put a bow on this, baby. It's over. That should be enough to wrap this thing up. The empty net goal should seal it. The Falcons are in the home stretch of this one, leading big time in the third. Matthews wins it in the neutral zone. Oh, and down he goes on the ice. Oh, he thought there was room. Obviously, there was none. Here's a shot, and that goes off the face of the goaltender. Uh, we used to laugh about this and say, oh, the goalie's got to answer the phone because his ears are going to be ringing, but I'm sure the trainer's going to check on him here as this hits him right in the face. From one end of the blue line to the other. Turn that one aside. The Falcons get a hold of the puck along the boards. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Quick shot, shuts them down. And we are all over with this one tonight. Winnipeg's coaches may nitpick to the point that they were on their heels a lot in this one, but this was still a dominant win. When they got the puck, though, over the offensive side of center, they were decisive, they were efficient, and look at the number of goals they scored. And that'll do it for Ray Pearl. I'm James Cebulski. Thank you.